everybody, welcome back to the channel. It's Cole and Jay, and we just recently went to our P.O. box, and you guys filled it up once again, so we are so excited to open up these packages. So I want to say a huge thank you for those who have sent us some mail. Uh, we really appreciate the thought and effort that goes into sending us mail. So without further ado, let's get to opening them. Yeah, but before we jump into the unboxing, I want to touch base again on the brand new Waterland Optics. The launch was a huge success, and these guys are still on sale on the website for 25% off. And if you punch in our discount code CJ10, you can get them for an additional 10% off. So if you're wanting to try out some brand new, really awesome fishing performance sunglasses, Definitely check these out. We'll have a link in the video description for you guys. Um, but yeah, without any further ado, let's get to the <laughs> unboxing. Let's start with this guy. Oh. I have a fancy for this guy. We got this guy and I was like, man, <laughs> what could this be? It's very small, but it's very heavy. It's probably like two pounds. Ready? It's a box. It's a inside box. of a box. It's a box inside of a box. Ready? And I have no idea who this is from. It doesn't have a name on there, but if this looks like your package, thank you so much. Okay. <laughs> What is this thing? Barbecue. Barbecue it says Bitty Big Q Compact. Oh, sweet! This is a like. Let me see on the box. Oh. This is a collapsible grill gra a grill grill rack grill oh, rack. Grill rack. <laughs> a collapsible <laughs> grill rack that you can take with you on your camping adventures. Yes, Woo! I've been wanting to go camping. That's We're gonna go box. camping really soon, so this would be really nice. Yeah, we've been waiting for like some of the rivers to get at a good level, and they've they've actually been at a good level for a little bit. But we need to get out of the house. Whoa, losing stuff. Whoa. So we can go on an overnight kayaking camping adventure. How do you undo this thing? Here it is. It's very very compact, which is really nice yeah. for camping or backpacking or kayaking or everything. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here's the legs. I don't know what okay. to do. It's... I think it opens. <laughs> oh shoot! There we go. There it is. <laughs> There it is. That's it. That's, I think there's more to it, but it's kind of, kind of complicated, honestly. We'll figure it out. But anyways, thank you so much yeah. for sending us this grill rack. It looks awesome. Definitely very compact. It's definitely going to be put to good use. So thank you yeah. so much to whoever you are that sent us this. Thank you. Very thoughtful. Next up, we have got a package, and it says from Abe Bentley out of Harrison, Ohio. Ooh. It says, please, please put in, in the video. Okay. Okay, since you asked nicely, <laughs> we will put it in the video. I see plastic bags. Usually that means fish baits. Feels like soft plastics. I love soft plastics. Ooh, you were right. I was right. Oh, let's look at the sampler. Here, let me hand you a couple of these. Looks like you got Ooh. some ribbon tail worms. Yeah. We got some brush hogs, and we got some lizards. I actually like this color a lot. Nice. This is called, I think it's called Pumpkin fire, pumpkin fire tail. I've actually caught a lot of fish with this colored lizard in the past. Really cool. And you got some black and blues. Yeah. Let's get a little handful. Let's get a little handful of sampler. <laughs> is there more? Oh, there's more. I forgot one. I forgot oh. one. What is that? Some crawfish. Ooh. There you go. Some red shad colored. I think these are. I think these are made by Yum. Little crawfish dudes. Check those out. Black and blue baby brush hog. Little lizard. This is a good little sampler pack. Yeah. Dear Cole and Jay, I have been watching your videos and I love your fishing videos. Aww. That's awesome. Thank you so much, Abe. We really appreciate you sending some of yeah, your lures. We'll definitely you. be putting them to use sometime soon. And like I said, this is deadly, deadly little lizard color. <laughs> they eat that thing in the spring. Jay, I'm what next. You got? I'm opening this one. Who's it from? Philippi. 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 I like that. I thought I brought a knife. You need it? Oh, yeah. Show me a knife. Hey guys, you always hate on me in the comment section or hate on us for not having pocket knife to open up the stuff. Got a bunch of pocket knives. Just like to keep it interesting. I really like this knife. This was given to me by my grandfather. We're gonna be using it here in just a minute, I think. Okay. Okay. I'm excited. First class mail. Here we got a letter. So letter says, Dear Colin J, my name is Scott and I am a new subscriber to your channel. I think what you guys do is outstanding and so far I really like the content in your videos. Well, not all of it. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not really a big snake fan. <laughs> But I am learning a lot from watching you guys. Your passion for the outdoors and wildlife in general clearly shows in all of your videos. So keep putting them out there and I'll keep watching and hopefully I can get caught up. I've seen a couple of things for each of you. Cole, I just saw the video where you caught the monster buffalo on crappie jigs and I felt for you once you realized you had no bucket. <laughs> so I made you a bright orange stringer out of paracord. Aww. Odd school should fit in your pocket and last. Jay, I made you this little good luck fishing buddy. I said a good prayer over him for you. Enjoy and keep casting for the slabs, Aww. Scott. 
Awesome. That's nice. Let's see what these things look like. Ooh, check it out. Ooh, that's nice. That's nice. I love the arts and crafts. I love, and I love paracord, so this is perfect. Bright orange paracord stringer, throw this thing in your pocket. Always gonna have a stringer on you. Really cool. Yeah, that's nice. Really nice. That's really thoughtful too. Is this mine? Yep, that's your little good luck buddy. Oh, there's my good luck buddy. You have to put that on your keychain or on your tackle bag. Yeah. On, we'll put it on our backpack we carry around, oh, around yeah. with us all the time. Yeah. You usually wear the backpack. Jay always hogs the backpack. I need good luck. <laughs> that's awesome. <laughs> that's for your next good luck trip. To catch a bigger fish than you. Yep. Awesome. Thanks so much, Scott. Thank you. David Yost. From New York. From New York. David wow. Yost out of New York. I love seeing like where, I mean, we know that we have people watching our channel from all over the place, but it's just fun to like, you know, just see where these things are coming from. Okay. I always get nervous. <laughs> okay. It, yeah, you have right to be nervous. We've unboxed some weird things in the past. Ooh! Ooh. That's a deadly little bait. I caught a bunch of fish on those baits when I was a kid. I used the mess out of these. These are like... The Mimic Minnow. Yeah, that's really cool. Turn our little light down. Check that out. This is a Mimic Minnow from Northland. I've caught, seriously, a ton <laughs> of pond, crappie, and bass on those things. I mean, I'm not Ooh. even kidding. I caught a ton of fish on those things whenever I was a kid. That's awesome. Really cool. I haven't used them in quite some time, but probably need to get back to use them. <laughs> so enclosed in the envelope, he sent a letter. It says, Dear Colin J, I watch your channel all the time. Greatest ever here in Rochester, New York. We have bass too. Enclosed is two of my favorite lures. Keep up the good work, David Yost. Thank you. Awesome. Thank one you so much. One for me and one for you. Yep, one for each of us. We'll have to have a challenge or something where we see oh, who can yeah. catch the most fish on these things. I'm telling you, these things are deadly. They're deadly everywhere, I, I think, but you. deadly in ponds. I mean, there's something mm -hmm. about it. Something about these little Northland mimic minnows. Sweet. That's exciting. Appreciate it. Appreciate Thank it. Thank you. I'm going in for a big one. We have two larger packages on hand. Ooh. By the sounds of it, kind of sounds it's like rattles. Like fishing bait. Sounds like fishing lures. <laughs> Okay, we got a letter. What's honey? Oh, I was kind of right. Gotta get back yeah. to the letter. I was kind of right on it being fishing lure, but I was not expecting this. Check this out. Look at this. It is a box of bags of chum, chum. pods. I've never heard of chum pods, but basically, you use chum to throw out in your fishing area and attract your target species of game fish to your area. And these look nifty. This is about attaching it to the hook. Yeah. Wow. Really cool. It says developed by a fisheries biologist and game warden. Huh. Let's see what this says. It says, hey Colin J, please check out my first gen chum pods. I'm currently a one man show, but I already have plans to improve the product, including a longer dissolve time. Mm. Mm. Sounds nifty. Cool. So also in the box, he has sent a little business card. His name is Grant Pierce. Go check him out. Definitely at chumpods.com. Mm. If you're interested in trying out these nifty chum pods. Really I'm cool. interested in trying them out. I want to like, here. <laughs> Are we going to smell them? We're going in. I'm interested. They kind of look like Tide Pods. Maybe that's what I call Chump Pods. <laughs> I'm not doing the Chump Pod Challenge. No. Not, oh, no, no, no. We're not doing a Chump Pod <laughs> Challenge. Unless you oh, lose a challenge. Wow. Check that out. Yeah. I get it now. It's like a Tide Pod. It's a fish chum. But we're not doing Chump Pod Challenges. Don't do Tide Pod Challenges, kids. Don't you do it. <laughs> that's dumb. Yes, that is very dumb. Look at that. That's awesome. We're definitely going to be taking really these out on cool. our next fishing adventure. So we do a lot of bottom fishing. We can go like to a spillway or even out here off our dock, probably toss these things down to lure yeah. a catfish in or something. Woo! There, I forgot to smell it. Oh. Wow. Yep. That, I like think that bait. is definitely going to work. And <laughs> it seems that he sent us a lot of time supply. So we, wow. <laughs> we should never run out. So thank you so much. Thank you so much, Grant. We really, really appreciate you sending us these chum pods. It's really cool, really nifty. All right. Next up is actually something that I ordered for <laughs> Jay and I. I'm very excited about this. I've had a hard time getting my hands on this, and it's because you guys keep buying them, which is which is good. This is in this package is arguably probably one of the most revolutionary new crankbaits to have hit the bass fishing market, and I'm excited to see them. I have a couple, but I hadn't I didn't have them in these colorways, and I really really wanted them, but was able to successfully snag them. Ready for this, guys? Check this out. These are the brand new Axis crankbaits from Six Sense Fishing. Um, you know that Six Sense is a big supporter of our channel and we love using their product. We've been using them for years and years and years and we've caught tons and tons of fish on them. And they're always innovating new things that you know just aren't available on the market. And while they're known for incredible paint schemes, like this is just this is just out of this world. This is out of the box. This is incredible. Let me show you guys this thing up close. Get out of the package. 
So basically, this is a 2.0 sized square bill crankbait, but it's called the Axis because if you look at the bill, it's kind of got this metal bladed bill and it pivots on an axis right there, which allows this bait to hunt like back and forth in the water, mimicking you know how a bait fish actually swims. Like no bait fish actually swims straight, or when they're feeling distressed, they're gonna be like darting around all over the place, and that triggers a feeding response from bass, and it's just truly incredible. I've had the privilege to get to throw these things for the last couple of months. Um, like I said, didn't have them in these colors, so I'm really, really excited <laughs> to have these guys, especially since now a bunch of shatters are moving on our area. Mm -hmm. I think we're gonna be able to really tear the fish up on them. I'm not sure if there's any available on the site right now, but keep an eye on them. You know, we'll have a link down in the video description below. And, uh, you know, anytime you shop on Six Sense Fishing, you use our code CJ10, you can save 10% off your entire order. Um, but be on the lookout for these guys. We'll keep you posted once they get back in stock. But this is a revolutionary lure right here. Super cool. But anyways, these are the Axis crankbaits. Go check them out. And let's move on to the next package. All right, next package is another biggin. And again, it sounds like fishing lures, but... As you just saw, we've clearly been wrong <laughs> before, but it sounds like fishing lures. It sounds fun. Sounds fishy, it sounds fun. Oh boy, I oh see no. a hat. Ba, ba, ba. Whoa! Whoa! Ching, Whoa! Ching. Jackpot. Awesome. We hit the jackpot. <gasps> oh what? Oh my goodness. And so we just got a monster care package wow. from a couple of our buddies over at Tackle HD. If you haven't heard of Tackle HD, definitely check them out. We'll have them linked in the video description. Um, they are a lure company based out of Central Missouri. I guess it's Central Missouri, somewhere in Missouri. And they make soft plastic lures that are very realistic, yes. really cool. Um, we first started using these baits. Uh, we found the Helgramite lure, which uh, there's probably some in there. Yeah. Just like there's a real a Helgramite. Helgramite. Yeah. Check those out. These things are deadly. These things are deadly. Like we love using these baits when we go like on our creek fishing expeditions because they they really look like real helgramites and real crawfish. And these look like yeah, these look like real crawfish. Yeah, super crazy. I mean, ultra realistic. Super nifty. Okay, so we got one, two, three, four, five. Don't tell me six. Six bags of the HD Helgramite lure. And all of the colors that we love. I mean, we throw this bait a ton on our creek mm -hmm. fishing missions. And we got one, two, three, four packs of the high def craws to go along with them. A couple different sizes, a couple different colors. Three packs of the HD mm -hmm. swim baits, three packs of jig heads. And we got two brand new HD worldwide buzzers. We were both That's making awesome. some new buzz baits. We were kind of going through our buzz bait selection the other day, and it's kind of, kind of jank. They've been beat up pretty bad. I'm gonna say a huge thank you to the guys over at Tackle HD. Uh, they're, they're great people. They make some great stuff and you definitely need to go check them out for sure. They've got some really, really cool things going on over there and they definitely catch fish. <laughs> definitely be sure to check these guys out. All right guys, well that concludes today's unboxing video. I wanna say thank you to each and every one of you again for taking some time out of your day to send us and write, send us a mail and write us some letters. Yes. It means the world to us, you know, just your support and everything that y'all do for us, it's just, it means everything. So I wanna say thank you guys so much for that. If you guys ever wanna send us anything, you can send it to our PO box linked in our video description, but that's gonna be it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed today's episode, please give this video a like, and if you haven't done so already, make sure you are subscribed to the channel so you miss out on any of our future outdoor adventures. We're, We're Paul and Jay, and we'll see you on the next video. Bye, guys.